So that's the thing right there. Take down bow. Ah! Oh my god, it's already. Oh, this will hurt. Initiating. Friday down in the studio again same setup with my archery release aids and the topic for this vlog is a tiny takedown bow got my carbon sticks so let's put them to good use as I already mentioned there are so many purposes so let's get started with the first one a takedown bow usually consists of three parts two limbs and a connection piece a rather simple connection piece right there god damn it just a pipe with a tiny divot, a tiny notch in there to center the limbs perfectly. That's a variation right there. And that's a 10% infill variation, maybe 20, I don't know. And that's a 100% infill variation. These are the string grooves right there, 3D printed as well, 100% infill. That's a tiny model with a two millimeter rod. These are the four millimeter rods, as you can see, working prototype. Kind of weak, but still funny. And this is the arrow right there with a knock. This is a bit too big. And a 3D printed arrowhead. And here I also have the bowstring. So let's put it together. First of all, let's test the weak connection part. I will just take the rods, insert them. I already tried something very similar with two millimeter rods and well it exploded spectacularly in my face so yeah this will be fun so that's the thing right there take down bow ah! <laughs> oh my god it's already making weird noises let's measure the draw weight 1.2 kilograms 1.6 Oh, this will hurt. I think it broke at around 1.5, maybe 1.8 kilograms. That's pretty bad. That's pretty lame. And that's the part right there. That's where it blew out. Rip. Next up is the 100% infill variation. That's a modified version with an arrow rest and I would rather not destroy this one. It would be a shame, so... Let's try this one. That's more like it. Let's see what we can do. Ah! 2.4? 2.5 kilograms. What the hell happened? Oh, that was actually the rod. RIP! That is bad. I did not expect that. To be honest, I did not expect that. Yup, that was the rod. Interesting though still in there it will start to make noises that's for sure when they are certainly not indestructible but they still bend fairly good so yeah one let's take this one so let's try to shoot some arrows with my tiny takedown bow with around two kilograms of draw weight or well 1.5 probably it's not too bad though. String it up. Move it in position. Knock and arrowhead. And now, just like that, I should be able to shoot it. <laughs> and for this, I will of course use my redesigned archery release aid. Figure 9 archery release aid. If you're interested, check out my shop. In my last vlog, I stress tested these release aids and they are incredibly sturdy. And the way how they work is you just take them like so, insert the string, you pull, and then you release. Just like that. It's easy, it's funny, and it is a very convenient. Let's just try it with my hands. I also prepared a target, so let's shoot it. Yo! <laughs> well, in the end, this is more like a toy. Well, but still a great proof of concept, I guess. I have even more concepts in the pipeline. 
coming right in my next vlog. You can check it out right here when it's ready. But that's enough progress for today. Smash and then like the way them carbon rods smash themselves. <sighs> Bang the bell like pakra. Check the recent news on chrisviral.com and subscribe for the viral vibe. Well, I will see you tomorrow.